Another problem area in our state is over in Gila County. Monica Garcia is over there where there has been some dangerous flooding all morning and through the mid afternoon. What's the latest over there in Globe? Well, they've been getting flooded since about two o'clock this morning, just pounded by rain. And by the way, we still are in a flash flood warning for another two hours. We spoke to folks from a mobile home community. More on them in just a second because they really saw a lot of devastation. But first, I want to show you this is Canal Creek, folks. This is as a result of days of rain over the burn scar. You can see mud and debris being carried down the creek by a fairly strong current. Now we've had folks all throughout the afternoon come out and take pictures. Lifelong residents who say they've never seen the current this strong. It's gone down a little bit, but throughout the day, one neighborhood in particular just devastated. This morning around 10 a.m., rushing waters and mud flooded the Little Acres mobile home community located between Globe and Miami. Residents spent most of the afternoon cleaning up after floodwaters came rushing down the canals over the burn scar from the Telegraph wildfire. At least three homes were overturned and several completely uplifted from their foundation and carried about a quarter of a mile to the opposite side of that mobile home community. We spoke to a resident, Elena Ashley, who says the water rose to about four feet. I saw literally a river going through our street. Saw a trailer that's right there, literally came through, floated like it, nothing was attached to it. I saw my neighbor's car run into my awning. My, thankfully, my house didn't shake when it hit. So those residents out there at the Little Acre mobile home community have just been through a lot. Hit by a flood this morning, then once again having to evacuate. And these are the mud waters, the flood waters, uh, rather, that people have been experiencing. This is water that's been coming down from the canals. Uh, last month around this time, we showed you similar waters when it was raining out here. At that time, the waters were black and muddy, if you guys can remember, because once again, this is from the burn scar, all that debris. And the reason why it's flooody now is because there used to be trees up there, and now there's nothing to block any of this water as it continues to rain. Now, rain is starting to pick back up. We did get a break for about an hour or so, but once again, it's raining, and again, we are still under that flash flood warning. Live in Gila County, Globe, I'm Monica Garcia. Back to you.